Merry Christmas, Leeds United fans. It has just ended at Ellen Road. Leeds United 4, Ipswich Town nil. What a performance. Leeds United have absolutely humiliated Ipswich Town. And I say that with chest. Before we do get into this match reaction, guys, be sure to smash that like button. Let's go for 300 likes. What a win. Top two, we're coming for you. Does it smell like manure? Because we're getting very close to them tractor boys. Also, subscribe if you are new as well. Come on, it's Christmas. 11 subscribers of 12.8k. Get down there and subscribe right now. And comment your man of the match and your thoughts on today's game. Okay, my man of the match. I don't even know. All of them are brilliant. I really love Archie Gray, though. Archie Gray, actually, I need to be careful what I say. He's 17. But what a win for Leeds United. Okay, it started off fantastically. And I, I always like to give credit to Ipswich. And I, I can't give them too much credit today. I, re I really can't. They really weren't at the races. I'll give them credit to what they've done, you know, throughout the whole season. Obviously, they're still seven points clear of us. So fair play. It could be as little as four come Boxing Day. Let's fingers crossed for that. But yeah, they really went at the at the races today. We know what they can do. And, you know, it's unlucky Leaf Davis had to have their mistakes. But, you know, Leaf Davis, he's always leads. Um, but yeah, disappointed from them. So fair play for the rest of the season. But, you know, we've played them now. We've played them twice. We've scored, you know, eight goals. So, you know, what can I say? We're just the better side. But you got a 70 million attack. Guess what? Shut up. It's Christmas. Uh, but yeah, we started off well. We started off, I mean, for the whole game, we were just fantastic. We really just were. We were, the, the, they didn't have a chance. I mean, the, the one chance they did have was when they hit the post, Connor Chaplin, good effort. But that's after we were 2-0 up. Our first goal was a was a lovely little goal. I can't even remember who scored the first. How did the first go in? Header, Pascal Stroik. It was maybe debatable that it was a foul in the middle of the park on Connor Chaplin. I thought it was a bit soft. It goes through. Leeds get the corner. Whipped in from Somerville. Lovely sort of chest sort of thing from Piro bounces down. Who follows it in? The captain, Pascal, with his big old Dutch head, puts it in the back of the net. Skipper, love that. We go 1-0 up. And then the second goal, lovely play. Again, they were debating a foul. It wasn't a foul for me at all. The first one was probably more of a foul than the second. Lovely ball goes through. Somerville takes Harry Clark on. Harry Clark, you may be an Ipswich fan, mate. But you're not an Ipswich player. He was terrible today. Put the ball across the box. Leaf Davis has smacked off him. Unlucky. I, 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 I don't. I, I love Leaf Davis, so I, I don't want to grill into him too much. Um, and then the third goal penalty. Somerville beats Harry Clark again. Or no, beats Leaf Davis again. Sorry. Oh, I feel sorry for Leaf. Uh, Somerville beats him. Clear penalty. At first, I was like, ooh. But then saw it back at halftime. It was Mick McCarthy. It was, uh, it was a clear penalty, that one. So uh, he gave the penalty. Lovely. I mean, you're putting it top in Somerville to make it 3-0 in the first half. Lovely little, you know, dominant first half. Some people were saying, yeah, the referee, blah, 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 whatever. We got in 3-0. And second half, it was cruise control. Piro, what a goal, by the way. And I thought he was fantastic today. Winning that ball back, he was fantastic. And his goal, nice little bit of feet. It was a kind of a misplaced pass from, well, actually, Archie Gray won the ball back well. Dan James goes, it was a, I oh, know it was Archie Gray, actually puts the ball into uh, Piro. Bit of a miscontrol. Rutter picks up the missing pieces. Tries to put it to Somerville. Deflection. Piro picks it up. Couple of step overs puts it into the back of the net. What a goal for that man. It's his 50th in the championship. And I think maybe like eight for us now or something. Fantastic. Fantastic. But in that second half, we absolutely just cruised it. We absolutely cruised it. Um, we had something in the end, like for the last 20 minutes, 78% possession, 78 possession, which is just brilliant. Um, it would be such a Leeds thing now to go to Preston and drop points. It would be. I don't want to be negative because I'm not. We've just beaten, you know, the second team in the league. 4-0, you know, and we've beaten 4-3 at their place. We've played Ipswich now and we've, we've beaten twice. If we do that with Leicester, fair play. Ipswich have got Leicester to play on Boxing Day, so it could be as little as four points come Boxing Day. But Leeds United just need to, you know, remain switched on because how many times have we beaten good teams and how many times we convincingly won games this season and then the next game we kind of just, you know, drop off. And what I did like today is we scored two, but we didn't come become complacent. And I think we've done that a few times this season where we've scored two and we've kind of just kind of done more tricks and stuff. But today we wanted more and more goals. But the game management in the second half was fantastic. It was nice to see Furpo get on, uh, back on the pitch. Gruev, uh, Willie Nonto was trying to make things happen. Bamford, Joseph, good substitutes. Jed Spence today was fantastic. Uh, Somerville, of course, he's fantastic. Best player in the league. Ruta, very well today. Piro, brilliant. Dan James, brilliant. Archie Gray, fantastic. Middle Midfield battle, we won it. Easily defence was solid. Joe Roden and Pascal and even Jed Spence. You know, everyone was fantastic. Melier had nothing to do. I thought his distribution today was a bit meh, but who cares? We won 4-0, ladies and gentlemen. Merry 
bloody Christmas. That's all I can say. Uh, my man of the match today, I've got to give it to Archie Gray. I think genuinely, I just thought he was brilliant. I really did. I thought everything he'd done, everything he touched was just fantastic. Uh, you could easily give it to Joe Roden, give it to Pascal, you could give it to Jed Spe You could literally give it to any one of them players. Maybe not Melier, because he didn't have to do anything. Uh, but he kept a clean sheet, and that's definitely what I wanted out of today's game, was a clean sheet. Um, and we got it. But yeah, it's a good three points. But at the end of the day, it's just three points. Yeah, we need to move on now. Keep it going. Keep the pressure on that top two. And I think that sends out a statement a bit. It's a bit like we haven't gone anywhere. We're not going anywhere. And uh, Southampton played QPR today. Uh, so hopefully maybe QPR can get... I don't see QPR. I don't have much faith in QPR. But um, yeah, we go again, Preston. Uh, I probably won't give you a match preview because it'll be Christmas Day. I'll have to do it obviously a day before. I might drop it tomorrow. I don't know. We'll, we'll see how we feel. If not, I'll be back with a match reaction after the Preston game. Uh, we start at half 12 that game as well. Um, so I will be giving you a match reaction for that. But all I want to say is, ladies and gentlemen, I hope you have a bloody good Christmas. And what a good start to, to, to you know, start the weekend off. I mean, it's not good in my household. My mum's got COVID. So all our Christmas plans are ruined. But Leeds and I get the three points. So it's it's all it's all fine. It's all, it's all good in the house. I don't think the rest of the family see it that way but i do uh but guys if you did enjoy this match reaction leeds united four ipswich town nil dominating humiliating one of the best teams in the league guys be sure to smash that like button i have been ollie ward you guys have been excellent thank you for all your support this year and uh well i mean we've still got a few games left of the year but have a merry christmas have a lovely time um and if you celebrate if you don't who cares you know, play Xbox. I don't know what I'm doing now. Guys, I've been Ollie Ward, and I'll catch you in the next video. Cheery. Oh, I haven't got my hand. Cheery. Oh, that was rubbish.